Look over my shoulder and watch as I create a 30 second nature observation for nature's wild things. See my workflow process for transforming raw video footage into something ready for publishing. This raw video is from a photo walk on September 21st, 2016 and it was in one of the parks located in Cabarrus County, North Carolina, and that is in the United States. butterfly today on beautiful flowers. Let's take a look at the clip we have to work from today. The total clip is almost a minute long and uh, we've got this beautiful butterfly here. I believe it's a male monarch. I think you can tell it's a male from the uh, little raised spots on the uh, wing right here. I believe the female doesn't have those spots. So I believe this is a male somewhere in care in the wings here. But uh, let's skim right through here. I know we're going to make you seasick. Uh, we're using Final Cut Pro X today on a Mac, and we're going to edit together a 30 second nature video. And uh, I kind of like I kind of like this little segment here. The wind's blowing, so he's moving around a little bit. I see the camera's moving, the wind's blowing, the flowers are blowing around very difficult shooting and getting something to hold still let's uh let's work with uh, this segment right up here i'm going to press the o on the keyboard and that's given us a selection here i'm going to drag that down to the timeline the timeline is where your videos get put together in final cut pro and uh we can hit shift and Z and that expands it out and you can skim through it a lot easier here. So we've got about 10 seconds worth of video and uh, near the end here, I think he flies away. There we go. We want to just include that fly away. So we're 12 seconds, but let's take a look here. I want to really slow down the action here so you can see what's better happening. Let me just see. Just trying to find a, a spot where I'll leave it right about there and we're gonna trim up some of this here and now we're down to about nine seconds of video Let's see what I've got here All right, notice there was absolutely no audio to speak of there other than a little bit of wind noise. So we're going to drop the audio out and we're not going to have any audio on this little 30 second video. And uh, quite a bit of movement going on here. Let me uh, 
go up here to my tools and I can grab the video and do an edit stabilization here and uh, you can see right there let's let's watch this it's going to analyze the total motion taking place in the video and uh, hopefully it'll help uh, stabilize the butterfly and we'll see the flowers kind of move around uh, an extra amount going through uh, another process here and we might even see it crop down a little bit when we're done going through the stabilization process all right let's take a look at what we have here All right, now that's moved it around a, a little bit. I think I I do want to get the uh, the takeoff here at the end. I like the way uh, that looks. But that comes with a little bit of movement around here. But so far, we're working with about nine seconds worth of video. Let's let's make this our thirty second video. Let's stretch this out and give it the slow motion here just by changing the duration of this clip and uh, let's uh, bring the timeline back so we can see the entire clip in the timeline let's just take a look here and so we can see him working that flower working that flower There are the flowers moving around quite a bit. All right, I think uh, that looks pretty good. Now the next question I have is, do we need any cropping to be done? He's pretty well centered in the picture. We lose it there just a little bit and then kind of centers and goes off. I think we're good shape there. And uh, let's give it a dissolve at the very end here. Turn the dissolve on and center the timeline a little bit. Let's get the dissolve. So we want to see him fly off. And then dissolve. Okay, we have another 30 second nature video in the can.